Here are Golf Week's staff picks to win the 2019 Masters at Augusta National Golf Club. Dustin Johnson, big fan of DJ's consistency this season with wins in Saudi Arabia and Mexico City and five top tens and eight PGA Tour starts. There's no reason to think he can't get it done at Augusta. He's been tied 10th, tied 4th, and tied 6th in his last three Masters appearances and just needs to get off to a better start. Opening round 73s in 2018 and 2016 put him behind the eight ball early. If he can shoot something in the 60s on Thursday, we love his chances to slip on the green jack it comes Sunday. Dan Kilbridge, Rory McIlroy. Rory McIlroy turns 30 in less than a month, so if he's going to complete the career Grand Slam in his 20s, now is the time. This will be his fifth attempt to become just the sixth man in history to do it. He won the US Open in 2011, the PGA in 2012, and the British Open and PGA in 2014. This season, he has a win at the Players, part of a great run of top six finishes in all six of his stroke play events. Ignore the loss to Tiger in the WGC match play, this is Rory's year. Christine Brennan, Rory McIlroy. Coming into this season's Masters, Rory McIlroy's career has followed a path like many heroes from classical literature. Having undertaken a quest, he's gone through trials and battles that have sharpened his skills and grown his self-belief. Now at 29, he is returning to the place where his most humbling defeat took place. But Rory is ready to finally vanquish this foe win at Augusta National and complete the career Grand Slam. McElroy is the best driver of the golf ball in the world and one of the game's elite iron players. If those strengths don't betray him, he could go 12 under on the par fives alone. David Dusek. Justin Rose. How many times can this tournament elude him? Despite being number two in the world, Rose's name isn't on the tip of everyone's tongue this week. But recall his last five starts at Augusta. Tied 12th, Tied 2nd, tied 10th, tied 2nd, and 14. It's time for Rose to graduate from gracious runner-up to a green jacket. Beth Ann Nichols. Jordan Spieth. He becomes Jordan-esque when he drives down Magnolia Lane. Forget his recent form and check his master's record. His imagination is greatly rewarded at Augusta National. His putter is money at Augusta National. Steve DiMeglio. Rory McIlroy. What he's learned from a slew of top 10 finishes is that he doesn't need his very best to win here. And history shows that even average putting is enough when allied with premier ball striking. The work he has done with the performance coach to manage the mental side of the game, not just this week, but over the long term, is another weapon that could prove crucial at Augusta National. Eamon Lynch. Tiger Woods. So what if his five 2019 starts have only produced a tied 10th in Mexico City and a tied 5th in the match play? He took his game up a notch in dusting off Rory McIlroy during that match play where it became apparent that the entire early season schedule was designed to prepare for this week. His surprisingly conservative approach going against the modern bomb and gouge approach was about Augusta, where risk taking is overrated until Sunday. The 75% swing used so far was about not hurting himself and building the peak form this week. Remember, no one's asking anymore if he's got the swing figured out, and there hasn't been a mention of chipping yips in years. Woods knows Augusta better than anyone in the field except maybe Phil Mickelson, and even at his lowest points, finished in the top 20 here. Tiger Woods will win his fifth Masters this week. Jeff Shackelford. So what do you guys think? Let me know your thoughts below.